Because you are on a specific diet, what is wrong? Well, true. Lent of coming. drink no liquor, eat no rice, no lent. You mean at the end of February? Yeah. Hey, hey. Ready, we are ready up, you know, to do the road. You know the code. Why? Oh, God, yes. So, that is the thing. You know, but if you go get into flowers, brother, see flowers there. <laughs> <laughs> One king. Love like the king. Oh. Tell her that you have burger king. Oh. What do you know when the man say, yo? Blah! Never got to the lamb, the black party! I say, yo! I'm mad! Mark! Yo! Shop is saying, what are you with this for? Yeah man, lobster pancake. Yeah man, sauce of fish. I never did with no. Yes. At the first, but decided to make oh. a video. Oh. But you always have food. Your partner, right? Your partner, right? Let's look at that. My money is up. Bartender team, where are we going today? I don't know. You are tired. Plumbing with the sex. No, this is my later. Hi. Good afternoon. Alright, we're ready to move. Okay, now that I want to go, we're gonna watch this side one. Yeah. King! Yo, where are the brother? Eh. Uh -huh. Can the right hand side, yeah man. Yeah man. Yeah. Yeah. King! Come come over here, man. Right, so yeah, yeah, right. So just sit down and then we'll link you up there, sir, yeah? Alright, brother. Go back to get it. Get it back. Yes, and man. put it back. And put it back. Dear. Right. <laughs> <laughs>
business. I mean, talk a uh, holy lot of things. Yeah. Like yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> follow me. Yeah. 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 Them oh, people that we have found already, found yourself. Yeah, no cash, card only. Call the tours. <laughs> yeah. Experience <laughs> Jamaica to the fullest. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you this. Mm -hmm. If you not have your money, you can't draw no card. Call mm -hmm. them take every, every card. Bang, <laughs> 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 <Spend> move. <laughs> <laughs> nice, that's clear. <laughs> Welcome. No, when? That's that's when I call me. When he was working. A free work Oh my God. Me need them. You need it. You need it. Me need them. So welcome. Yeah, man. 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 Yeah, or bite. Which one? Yo, you want to bite? There you go. Hello. Mark, suck or bite? Say, we can't get both like I get the orange one. Oh, you mean suck and bite? Suck and bite. Look at him, I'm going to have a bunch of. Look at him, I'm going to have a bunch of. <laughs> we can't do that. We're going to the orange. Suck and bite because I'm just turn it over mm -hmm. and plug out the peg and bite. Mm -hmm. I swallow and chew. I'm going to decline all of them. I'm going to suck and bite. I'm going to suck and bite. We're not going to be the year old. Why? We're not going to be the year old. We're not going to be the year old. Say, yeah. Jamie, I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. I you not care, we not care now, brother. I picked up the top of my soup. What kind of food? I don't care, S word, we're not going to say. You take me, 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 <laughs> Says plummy with the sexy tummy. <laughs> okay, let them know what your pre men's doing. Mm -hmm. okay. Did it? Is this like the get up there. <laughs> 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 Oh, get up and say that. Pass, pass it, pass it. Move it in, move it in, move it in. Where's the garden? First one, you fling me, Oh, God. I wonder, girl. 
If it never lick, so you'd want it for lick. Hold on, hold on. 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 Hold on, Listen on the side. Bingo? No, man. Bingo? Yeah, bingo. Yeah, bingo. Bingo, where bingo? Yeah, bingo. Where bingo? Right, Radisha. 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 For you, um, you know, you like it. Here in Bartender, yeah, I actually love it. You love it. Yes. <laughs> what is your favorite scene from the Bartender? Uh, it doesn't have to be one that you're in. It can be any, any, anyone. Actually, we did impressed by the court scene. The court it scene. Did actually look realistic. Okay. And who is your favorite character? Uh, yeah, it was Five Five Shepherd. Five and Shepherd. Before all of this, that's where. Okay. So after talking to Diamond, it's only fitting that we talk to uh, who, what we call him, our handler, <laughs> our boss, Speng. Yeah. Boss, Mr. Speng. Now, I know you are a movie buff. Yeah, you, yeah, you, yeah. You, you love movies. Yeah, man. Perfect. And so, how has this experience been for you? Um, you know, just, just share with us how, how the experience has been. You know, it's been great, man. I love, I love the, you know, it's my first real um, for in acting, you know, like as a character, but this is, um, you know, after, of course, I have to big up Mr. Hall, you know what I mean, coaching me through 
to get me through. But me, you know, me in you know, you know, a couple movies before as, as extras or whatever. But you know, like even when they're LA, and you pull up on the movie sets them and see all them beat out in the desert in the middle of nowhere. Right? Realize so, me just love movies. So, you know, being in this a part of this, I think this is like what a lot of Jamaicans can experience. There are so much elements in it that Jamaican people can relate to. So, you know, being a part of this, I, I think you know, it's, it's, not, it's not just a series, it's like it's a whole entire vibe. You know, what I mean, as we Jamaica would say, it's not just a series, it's a vibe. So, All right, you know. so share with us your process in 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 carving out this thing character well you know of course we have to listen to the director you know they know the vision that they have and then we you know have to add our personality to it. um when the character was described to me they described somebody that i knew um because me know somebody when he was spang you know my uncle didn't spang in a real life and he's really a you know a dan figure oh zin it's a bit smart as well so run thy family yeah so <laughs> you know it, it was really a character that you know which spoke to me on a personal level so yeah it, it, it fit me and you know it's, it's a while that i've been trying to as i said you know um get into acting like the real way but you know but you no, know, i'm i'm a solo artist you now so i kind of give you know, more room for kind of thing, you know who is your favorite character in the series um we have a few you know um Shopee. I'm a favorite character in a real life, you know, Shopee kind of remind me of myself. And, um, you know, Big Boss them, them and, and the granddad as them, yeah. Okay. Um, is there anything that you think we could add, subtract, change, divide to make the series better? Um, to make it better, well, the only thing I, 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 I as a musician, see is the audio, you know, just work on the audio and but everything else, you know, the editing is good. Um, of course, you know, so as time progresses, you're gonna increase the quality. But the audio, once you, in, you improve the audio, I think it, it can reach another level because you know the audio is more important enough times than even the video itself. So yeah, man. But away from the storytelling, there's not that. It, it's just it's perfect, and it's gonna get even better. I hope. You know what I mean? Because I, you know, as Mr. Arvil is a brilliant person when it comes to storytelling. So. Spin off, send them look at something. I mean, I love them thing. Is it? Cool. Yeah. That means that's a lot of stuff. All right, so. Welcome to Goodable's Bar. We are track star from there and far. This is the bartender, Plummy. With a sexy tummy. We make man bummy. Got him over a gummy. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right, so, Plummy. Um, no, I, I know you have been acting for a while. Yes. You know, uh, we have worked together, uh, I think, once. Now, how has this experience been for you? It's been good. Um, I enjoy the fact that I play two characters, Melissa James and Plummy. I love the creativity that Arville uses to bring both characters to life. I love the the feeling when I'm in the bar, you know, I've never been a bartender before, but that, that feeling, that, that effervescent feeling to know that, you know, I'm playing a character that is opposite to myself, it makes it interesting for me. Okay. Well, a lot of people, I don't think, realize up to this point is that you were Sister Penny in Corner Shop. Yes. And is, well, I pointed out to a couple of people and they're like, whoa, we never realized that. Yeah. So, how is that process, you know, that transformation, moving from a, a, a Christian character which is closer to you, yeah. and then coming to um, Plummy, who is it's far? What is that transition like? It's it's easy. Um, I am a Christian in real life, and playing Sister Penny was second nature for me, and transforming into Plummy now, I had to dig deep to find that to find that oomph to, <laughs> to make it you know look realistic that I'm actually a bartender and the fact that I'm trying to impress Miss Goody that makes it more interesting for me and it's like every time I'm in the bar I'm trying to do something better to be a better bartender what, what I find interesting about that is that your character is actually playing a character yes <laughs> So that, that sometimes can be troublesome for an actor, but you seem to handle it very well. 
and I must commend you on that. Thank you. What? Who is your favorite character in the show? Honestly, <laughs> honestly, everybody, everybody is my favorite. But I have a special. Lately, I have a special thing for Pink Boss because I think that he likes. Me. <laughs> I think that he likes plumbing. Wow. So I have a little special soft spot for him in my heart. Oh. <laughs> soft spot. Soft spot. Oh. Soft spot. Oh. I mean, oh. like, <laughs> Alright, what is your favorite scene in the show? My favorite scene. Mmm, that's hard. In the, in in season five, in season or five. In, season in season five. five. My favorite scene was was when the Danda does them come from Slimmer's turf. And she pulled for her machine and <laughs> that, that, that was like a, that was like a, a moment where I say, yo, this coming like a real movie. Like it's just it was it was off the chain. I love that that scene in season five. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no, Sir Aaron. Yes, sir. Um, but that's the character's name. But Tino, you uh, this 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 would have been your first acting gig. Definitely. How has that been for you? Is it? I mean, I know we demand a lot. So just tell me how it has, how it has been for you. Um, yo, it hard. It did hard for getting to character. <laughs> you know, at first, at first, you know, it, it kind of seem as if there was a disconnect to me, and especially because of the fact that he's a liar. You know, and it's more like a jacket and tie kind of. That, that's the, that's the perception, yeah, that I had in my mind. You know, and watching a lot of movies and stuff, that is generally my perception of lawyers. But then after a while, with with some guidance and instructions from you know Villa, Arville, you know, him really show me say, all right, here we just be as natural as possible and you know them coaching it kind of helped me to get more comfortable and relaxed with the character so I think after after a little while you know we kind of started more comfortable with the character all right um what's your favorite scene from this season uh hmm. I try not to pick a scene like God already. No, but if that's your favorite scene, the quarter scene and the and the the dandar scene, that, that yeah man, they go hard. But um, yeah man, yeah them the, the tense, intense, and I mean even from 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 people generally, not for them, but just them seeing that them really, you know, okay. always are. Uh, and do you have a favorite about. character? Ah. Uh, Read the shop boss, you know. Yeah, man. Right. Code is life. <laughs> <laughs> so the man that everybody love to hate, I'm glad you take that title there from me. You know, because <laughs> I, I carried it for as long as I could. So how has that been for you? That that experience when you're on the street and people uh, heal you. Because them say them hate you, but I know when them see you, it's a different vibe. It's Trust a totally me. different vibe. Because I went through the same thing. So yeah. tell me, how has that been for you? Well, well, I can tell you the first thing that they say is, they say, boy, you're too nice to play a person there. <laughs> and I'm like, thank you. But of course, the general thing is, them hate me. Them can't stand me. And me think Carlton did bad, but you're like one million times more than Carlton. You're evil. <laughs> but, um,. The general feedback is that persons I'm easily recognized um, everywhere I go and it's, 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 it's just a pleasure to meet the fans, meet persons who are, they're so in tune with the show you can tell. Um, it doesn't matter what character you play or who, they ask for everybody but for me it's always, you can't leave Goody alone, you ever make something to the baby? You know see Carlton I try to be good again, leave Carlton alone man. <laughs> And it's always me. I'm like the worst person in the show forever. But it's alright, I can live up to it. Well, I will tell you, it means you're doing your job and you're doing it well. Whenever the people reach a point where it's it's almost like they really, really hate you and realize that means you're doing your, your job. Um in terms of getting into character, is there anything special that you do for, to, to, to channel 
that energy, that that, that character of so, Marcus? True, a good question. So initially, I was just doing lines, and the director always put on the phone, kind of thing. But what I do is actually watch a couple of videos in terms of local politicians and the sus part of politics and the kind of trouble they get into. Don't want to name names, but you know people always get in trouble. Um, I tend to use that, and in terms of the character being and the, the bad guy and the posture, right? Mm -hmm. The bad guy, the, the, the person, yeah. So I tend to use that as well, and um, pretty much prepare myself to go into a role to be hated or to be cynical or just to be, you know, sarcastic in general. So yeah, I do that. Uh, what 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 scene? From season five is your favorite scene. Oh, it's more a moment for me than a scene. Okay. It's, it's when you were leaving Goody's place on the phone and the mad woman aka <laughs> Godmother Ninja <laughs> and she walk up and I tell him your test for the editing for that scene had me weak when she walk up slow and the look in her face and the intensity on her face. I never even know what was going to happen. The thing he gets stabbed at the other. That moment for me was like very, very epiphanistic. Very, very nice. Alright. Do you have a favorite character in the series? You know, so my favorite character, I'm a sister in law, Goody. I um, <laughs> love Goody. Goody. Goody have a way of delivering her lines. Um, that is. I don't know, it's, 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 it is more than believable and she's so flawless with it. Um, I think she's a very good actress. Um, it's, it's Watching her before joining the series, she was my favorite actress and still remains the same. Yeah, so if I do, it is definitely goody. So goody, goody, goody. Did you have, uh, did you get any formal training in acting? Um, yes, I did. I've um, been doing acting from primary school, come right up. But in terms of formal training, it was Orville himself. I uh, was driving one day, going to work, and Fame came on with a, a program, a ad, small stages production that Orville and another member was putting together. And I went. Um, Janice was a part of that team. Um, big belly Janice in terms of Tommy and Tamara, yeah. And, 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 and Dogbed. Um, yeah, so. That training sort of propelled my ability to understand stage, understand expressions, moments, and stuff like that. Thanks to Orville, yeah, made it official. So this would be the face of the old foot then? <laughs> not do that, not do that. Not do that. Yeah, this is the Rakai. Now look how many knows how many of us know all of them. You don't understand that one. Yeah. From them times. <laughs> Never planned. Who's Bob's big friend from me? Um, all right, so I'm going to go start with the three musketeers. I'm going to be friends with each other. Bob's first. No, I'm good with she first, a five first. Remember after she brought her self and she walk out to your place. No, we're about season five. No, we're about to go to the same as she big first. Me big second. <laughs> All right, so let me start Begi, with. Begi. Let me start with the <laughs> five. Five. Has there been any development in your character? I mean, so from a personal standpoint, do you feel like you have developed as an actress from right. season four? No, you know, cause we didn't get no size on. <laughs> yeah, so from season one to season four, yeah, but from four to five, no, 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 I know that. Mm -hmm. But go, I'm a the place. I'm going to say, all right, this is my house. Slim as get it. Say, all right, fine. We see one next look apart. Then put it in a dream and say, a thriller place. We say, <laughs> all right. We go as far as say, here we Come on, my yard. Sassy, come on, my yard. Come get my own house. Not my real house, you know. <laughs> my real house. Me give the man and say, my house. He said, I'm going to get sassy. 
So, I'm um, talk to the director. She said, I want to go to the house now. From season one. And that's what I said. She's going to shop your name, she's a smelly girl. I want to go to the house man. I want to go to the house I'm not coming back in season six. I know my theme right, season six. Yo. I'm gonna read the script. I'm gonna see say five. So she'll go rent somewhere. I shall tell Bubble say, Yo, you know, I'm going to look somewhere. Come. Not coming I back. I'm going to look somewhere. It's supposed to walk in, push a key in the door, right? have your mm, place. Yeah. 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 We have a director. Yeah. Director, fix things. <laughs> Something, man. All right. Earth. The scene. Explain the process of moving from. Oh, I said this fitness sound again. From man to man. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know say. So, yeah. So, you, you leave oh, Shappy, you went to Triller. And Triller passed, and you had to. You, you wanted to go back to Shappy. Explain how the character felt when you go to the house to see the next woman there. If the grunt could have swallowed her, the grunt just open up and just take her in. But. I think five need for just bail and take some time for yourself. That's my honest opinion. How much time do you need? Just relax now, my man. You have to feel. You have to feel first, you know. You have to feel first, no matter what your mother talk to you and somebody else. You have to feel. You have to feel. You have to feel. You have to feel. You know what I mean? Think boss available. No, I said, blow me, blow me, blow me. Think boss available to who? Wow, wow, wow. Boss is not available. Wow. Alright, so goody plum. Persons have been asking and speculating about your size. <laughs> that you have grown. Yes. <laughs> you know, yeah, well, you see, um, the beginning of season five, I went to the doctor, and the doctor was saying, yes, there's something growing. <laughs> in my stomach. My baby, I just listen. <laughs> All right, so sorry to burst y'all bubble. But it is real. So I like what debate person. So I like real. Yeah, real. <laughs> All at what debate on Sunday day time it do real. I'm a live me live on the same road and me live up the road and <laughs> yeah, so, right. yes people. Yeah, you really, right. I guess when, when I edit this, more ever show the before and after. When you really look on my nice cute narrow look of face and my look of nose. No, look on me no 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 <laughs> 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 Look on my face now. Remember you had a fart a long time. Look on my face now. Look on my face now. Look on my nose and my mouth and my face just big. And I said, I'm not seeing it and the people are on the It do really do. You know, wicked to me, you know. But that's why we don't have fun. We don't have fun. We don't really see what we see. Because I did it every week, I cuss myself on the camera. I said, look, I'm ugly. And then they pan. Who did this? Yeah, and tell the people the problem or the director have with you. Hold on. People. So you know a farming village you have to show me and tell me you're the nice that a black brown. Black brown. Yeah. A truck and then something. But please tell the people the, the problem the director has with you in the early stages when you had said don't shoot down your son, <laughs> shoot up your son. Mm -hmm. And then no another angler, sir, don't come in so close. My nose are so you and how much time you have to change the angle. <laughs> full, fully, fully, fully For stretch. Sure. But trust me, it never, it never easy. It never easy because, alright, it's because me know myself. I don't want to pick up, you know. I don't want to pick up so early. But because I know myself, me I say, no man, my belly, then I go see my belly, I'm going to keep on having to shoot up as alone. Then when I shoot, I'm going to say, where you come up in my face so far? <laughs> Look at my nose, where you come up in my face? So I couldn't wait for say, alright, the belly start growing out, so I'm going to take some long shot. Car. Why may I tell you, I'm warm. <laughs> <laughs> But yes, people, it is real. Okay. And it's not that good, baby. People sit up on the road and ask me if the baby I got named Little Bow Wow. What are you doing? It's not that good, baby. Wow. And it's not that good. Little Bow Wow. Yeah. Little Bow Wow. Yeah. Little Bow Wow. Sure. That was so. Bubbles. Yes. AKA Angela. An uh, Angela. Reset. Mm -hmm. Now pronounce it properly. AKA Roman. 
AKA. As you reach that, as you as you reach that, AKA there. Bubbles. Um, for for me, one of the most challenging scenes. I don't know if you have a next one. Um, visual visually, was when you pop down and look like a a rummed. Yeah, Was that very challenging for you, or was there another scene that was more challenging? Mm. You know, the director said bubbles if they were so good. <laughs> Alright, um, that scene wasn't, it wasn't, alright, it was challenging because and I like, made it really a drink. Um, but it wasn't challenging because I knew that. No, no stop it. Alright, <laughs> I love, I love to drink. I love to drink. I'm not an alcoholic. <laughs> I love to drink. But um, in challenging in the, in the sense, yes, that I had to become an alcoholic. I had to become um, being a junkie. I am always the person where my house have to clean. My old things have to in an alley. I can't come in my house with your shoes. <laughs> Uh, all those things so yes it was that was one of the most challenging scenes for me so we can answer that question let's jump through the window the minute you're not smiling out no problem <laughs> and this is not our end we're not our ball five from man to man you know so every season you have a new man to we don't know the man from the first three seasons of them we don't know the man, I mean, you just have man, but we don't know the man. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, don't be man. Yeah, don't be man. Listen, that is why in the show, coming to the, you know, when things are broke out, you all found out that I was a detective. I never have no man at the time, even though I did so called. Seem like me in a one with him. No, I keep one. There's one that is there. Don't worry. All right, this is a question when I did one. One test for ask um, Aaron mm-hmm. how easy, how challenging is it to work with um, <laughs> your, 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 your boyfriend? Wow. Um, like with scenes that you have to play close. All right. Um, shut your shut, shut up now. When you get to you, watch me. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Um being an actor or an actress, you have to become the character. So it's not in scenes like those, it wasn't Shelly who was in the scene. It was bubbles. I have to play the bubbles role. I have to play like I really my man. In the character, he's really my man. So we can't make it seem like no. I play it real. So people it can become believable. I mean at times I know Aaron was uncomfortable, but um never dry me now. You're not only in a star blue move like me. I mean me I've been getting a part of the time. Me I've been a bathroom a beard. Move where you know about me. Remember some of in a bathroom with cards and a beard in a rub done wall. What a one the horn star, what a one you come on my time to show that. You give, me, you give me a hard time for shoot that. Oh. And you the part where look more. The part where look the part where look the easiest. And the part where look the part where look the easiest. And 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 the part where look the easiest. I have no problem with that. I mean, I say, how oh, you? I'm mean, gonna I mean, get the logic. I'm gonna get the logic. I understand. So, all these cousins are going. We are talking about the other points. That is not really an accolade. So, if you walk and tell people, your mother never grow yourself. <laughs> like, pull it in, sister fam. <laughs> Pink boss. I'm gonna come back. Yes, man. <laughs> yes, man. <laughs> so, how are you? Pink boss, the yes, people want to know what's going on with the employment. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> that so the no, you know what I say, you know what I say, in, 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 in life, yeah. sometimes when you're there in a park, people always are telling you, you need God in your life, you know? Mm. You see me? And me just got one bar one day and me just met the sexy goddess. The tummy, the tummy. Alright. Tummy. Me meet the tummy. Yeah! <laughs> you yeah. see me? <laughs> And they get the gummy. gummy. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, we just get the thing right, gel up, and gummy. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, man, but don't worry about me, I'm plumbing, man. 
Yes, All right, the, Dan, the Dandada, the, the Pink Boss character, is that a character that is close to you as a person, or you have to, you have to find a character that when it's time for shoot? All right, Pink yeah, Boss character now. <laughs> pink Boss character is exactly what you see, is what you get. You know? Because on the first day of the shoot, the director said, well, you don't have to 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 use any lines today or nothing just be yourself and from that day i was being myself up until today so what you see is what you, you get, get. Mm -hmm. pink bass in the show pink bass in a real life, life. Mm -hmm. and code is life and a game dan dada six love boss Yes! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dada! One six now. <laughs> the character Dan Dada. Is this a character that is oh. close to you? Is there anything that you'd have to look upon to develop the character? <laughs> <laughs> to develop the character. <laughs> Mm -mm. Don't say natural life. What the fuck said I'm going to so? Um, so, Dan Dada, are you a community oriented person naturally? <laughs> yes, naturally. Yes, naturally. Yeah, man! Let me ask someone. 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 Basically, me is, me is naturally a, okay. a boss. You know what I mean? I don't really push people around. So, when you get to the show as a pink boss, I eh, what happen in a real life. You know what I mean? Oh, my all right, people in the so serious in a real life. You laugh, you fuck me. <laughs> all right, what them say about people who love laugh? Easy for lie down. <laughs> 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 It's for the lady. They say a girl will love laugh. Okay. And that makes you get belly. <laughs> get them. So what the man them will love laugh? Bad people. Bad people. Bad well, in a real life, on our friends, and you guys have been friends um, right throughout the, the, se the series, did you have to channel the character to get to a place where you and them fall out? You don't want to, and I want to tell you, you're not even have to ask me the question, I'll answer it before you ask me. That was one of, because I have two of them, the most intense scenes for me. Because I deal with my friend them like I don't want to deal with my friend them. You know what I mean? I learn from some great people. You know what I mean? So when you get into a character, you have to deal with just that. You understand what I mean? And I have to move away from them for the time before we actually start the scenes. You know what I mean? Go over here, them and forward. You know what I say? Mm -hmm. Yeah, when I'm when forward, I don't like my friend them. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's all a long time after. All days after we still not like one another. You know what I say? I'm mean, not talking about onset. You know what I say? But all that after I say, you yeah, say all the boy shot boss walk past me and don't even yell me. Cause me is still there in a character. Sometimes I have to shake it from different ways. You know what I say? No, but like that it. was hard. You know what I say? It was it was yeah, really when really. When we see that, that's when we see that part there. Mm -hmm. Almost the director say yo, 
You know, say we not do it that way. Yeah, we can't do it again. We not do it that way. It is intense, you know. We know, say at things that mean a real life and a real life thing. We not project, but me do one for sure. Say yo, sure say yo. We have a team where the man them not. Even though we not. You see me? Nah, shake, you know? Yeah. You see me, we nah yeah. shake, but we nah have no argument at all. We always just talk over things. Yeah, but reality, you know? Say, uh, uh, yeah, but we never really like that. We I'm never had a proof. Because we know you have to go into character. So you're trying to say, director, he ain't a director, a fussy. No, no, man, director, he ain't. Basically, he ain't. Okay, you say a good use of honest word. Basically, he ain't. Basically, he ain't. Basically, he ain't. But to go in other character, they think, to pray, my friend, because as Rough, I say, even after the show, I still have set up yeah, to man. land that yo. Boy, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Quick, I pray them wicked still. You know what I'm saying? Quick. Yeah, make it quick because we have a day at the time. So you have a day. Yeah. We hear you. We hear you. We hear you. So I think we're going to reveal at the end of this um, episode um, who your huh? date is. Cause somebody actually win the date, yeah. So we're gonna show for them face, but not your face. Yeah. Ba -ba 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 -ba. We're gonna have to wait. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Slow go. Yeah. All right. <laughs> not that always on time. Sure. Never late. Quick foot. Mm. One of the things where people tell me so them rate with you is how you're true to the character by even in public. You keep the kerchief over your face oh. to ensure that people. Um, and I see a face. Is this something that was told to you by the director or something where he just decides that you are going to keep the mystery? Um, I always like kerchief or type of made on them, something about I guess I just say Corona protocols and something like the original mask, something of my mask. So it wasn't difficult for you to no. keep this mystery? Not at all. I don't know, we plan it in, because we know it has an intrigue them. You know. They might want to know who the man behind the mask. Mystery. So the mystery is the mystery. Yeah, alright. The, yeah. the man is just the man. And the man is just the man. Because you don't know who's here, people, you don't know who's here. 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 Man in those are gay. That's true of my life for this. So quick. Yeah. What are your expectations for a season six? Where you see the quick foot character go? In a church, man. Whoa. That's the church. Quick foot are changing my life. Then I pass. Whoa, whoa, that church, that mushroom. Something, alright. You don't feel like that. Where you think then? Where do you think you do then? That doesn't sound like you could. That's all like look at the area around that. Something, alright. A good thing we're in that deal again. Alright, so. So, I'm going to cut that section here. And then when the camera turn on, when the next person want all of them to call out him name. Uh, uh, Dutty liar boy. Who is this? Dutty liar boy. You know something like no, no. We don't like you either, brother. I never like your first man. I don't say that's okay. That's all right. I think Tyrone is single and the only character in the show where nobody need to like him, but everybody need him. No. All right. So Duffy, my brethren. Yeah. The. The switch from being a stand-up comedian, one of Jamaica's um, top stand-up comedian now, the switch from that to becoming uh, an actor, where you're delivering lines that was, uh, you write your jokes then, but somebody write lines now for you to follow. How easy or how difficult was that? Uh, it, wasn't, it wasn't difficult, because being a stand-up comedian doesn't mean that you're laughing all the time. You understand? Mm -hmm. There's some serious issues sometimes you have to make. You have to turn serious issues into a comedic set. Uh, so for me, it was it was more intriguing to a challenge, like, all right, and cool. How am I going to take on a character? Yeah. Now, even with the name, because the character wasn't supposed to be Tyrone first, you know. What? what, what Stacey, when when, when the name of the character was supposed to be first, man? And then I said, yep, you have a different name first. The first, first. And then I said, no one called Tyrone Long. <laughs> it's the long when you change the name, that wasn't the name of the character first. Switch it up because I say, yeah, no man. Character need like a swag in eye. <laughs> Especially if it's dirty Carlton. 
<laughs> I remember. All right. Is there, is there, when you started in the series, mm -hmm. did you see the character developing to where it is now? No, actually, because I didn't know. That me for, people, I beg me for beg the director for write me back in high school. Confession for the Beg me back because from my almost. Wallet, 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 we don't have no woman there, so. <laughs> and that we are talking about too. The Dandaras, them are both men. We have, we have, no, what, what? no, 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 no. Ah, that's no, no, big no, boss. No, and it's no, 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 Quick foot, yeah, quick foot of him, girl. Yes. Remember me a plumbing now. Whoa! Yes. Whoa! Oh my God! Shot. Remember when me get shot? Uh huh. You're you're a nurse, nurse girl. girl. Nurse girl. Wow! Nurse so, you want to hide? Yeah. Yes. All right. What? Well, five. We have brought Five there. Five help. Shop it. Two girls. Five help. Him up. Him up. Him up. So. 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 Five need a house and then they need a woman. Yeah. Yeah. And the liar and the liar, you. Yeah. Next week, people come here. Come here. Like, come here. Like, I will live somewhere to have a Like, I can't I either kiss, I do with every woman. The wickedness of them. And we we'll like them bad and rough. Tyrone's a little bit. done. Stop. Moving right along. One king. Hear me say. One king. Long live the king. That was there all year. Any so, other king? A grooving king. Grooving king. Yeah. And, them, and the maestro and the dancing no. thing. Okay. You see it. No. Patrick, my general, for years. Just tell him quickly uh, the years of experience. <laughs> You know, I told them I, I talked to one lady and she asked me that, and it, I finally ended up counting. And I think it came about 30 something here, because from 89, 89, I had a professional theater to know. So, I don't do the math, because I don't have the scholars. You see? Now, when you have a, the, the king character, is that a character that you had to channel, or is something that you've, you've, you've been close to? It is something that I've been close to, and you know, it's like I applaud the opportunity to kind of play the character because it's so close to a life that I have led for the greater part of my life, you know, because I've been some kind of, you know, from the gangster alley for a minute, you know, being a community activist, a political activist. You know what I mean? So it's kind of a thing that we must see and know the, the ins and outs of it. And it gives me the opportunity of a show. You know, youths today that, you know, as glamorous as it might seem, you know, sometimes you need to think long term because only three people profit out of badness. You understand? People like Dutch Tyrone, the liar boy, yeah. because the liar them are charged crazy hey, money. No, no, man, you understand? No, no, no. The court system and the flipping undertaker. Oh, because I, I didn't wear the old title, you know, the truth in the road after no badness, you know. So, in giving this oh. item of entertainment to the public, we want to see the method in the madness. I know just the king, the bad man, but see the message very much, sure, you. Yeah. Said how certain things go. You understand? For real, because I write, they say it that. You understand? Which means that you enjoy using this opportunity to teach the, 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 the youths them about the, the dangers of badness. Not only enjoy, I am grateful for it. You know what I mean? And we want to really use the medium to attract more youth. Like there's other things we can do. You know what I mean? Because it's crazy, you know, when you think about Jamaica today and the average youth, anywhere from 15 to, say, 20, you know, 
Gold Knight him have an AK-47 where value of over 700 grand with a full clip of 30 at $700 for each bullet in at the clip and him a bust it all night and when daylight him want to grab a or a sheet of wrist lad that not right so what happened some of the money there if you need to believe it, that crime then buy a piece of old car and run it wide plate you understand me prefer that me not encourage breaking the law no you know, because I'm in a really the inner character right now, so I'm a badness me a preacher, realness me a talk about. You know what I'm saying? But if you have a break, the lab, you go run through taxi and try to care for the people in life, said we. But this money I invest in some high powered weapons. And by the way, where them gun they come from, come here? That's again. Because mm -hmm. them come on away about them, can't afford to bring them in. You mean a little picnic? I'm a say, gated community the other day have 13, 10 of them have brand new rifle. You understand? So. It's like somebody is benefiting from making these weaponry available to the underprivileged youths in a community who already said the prayer and angry. Them just are look at how we play for vent. So right now we have the, the society in that state of mind where every youth want to make dopey. Them don't want to make money. Them don't want to make house for their mother. Them don't want to make not even a pot of food. Them just want to make dopey. What sense in that? One king. Long live the king. Bap, bap. All right. The contractor. The no politician. The jealous. The bad man. Carlton Wallace. Prisoner. Prisoner. I know I ain't little brother. I know I ain't little brother. No. Tesfa, yes, sir. They, they know you on screen. Please alert the people about the other areas of the production that you are intimately involved in. Wow, all right, so here it goes. We love a call, man. I said, Brother, oh, you stay today. I said, All right, now work. Because I do have a 9 to 5 at the end of Monday where I am a multimedia technician that is video editing the same way, music editing, music engineering because I'm also an audio engineer and a musician. So, Villa will call me and I say, alright, I have, have, can make it about 2 o'clock or so. I will reach, I have to set, help set up light. <laughs> so, um, I train Shanice in, in lighting so when I'm not there she can take over from me. So, with the lighting. So that happened throughout the week where we shoot. Then on a Saturday, Villa will put the show together in terms of which scene comes. Then he send it to me, and then me sit down every Sunday morning, which I have to first say big up to my wife and my daughter, because they made the ultimate sacrifice where that's their time, but still, them understand say, they have to work, and this is part of my work. I'm going to sit down from sometime from 6 o'clock in the morning and at 4 o'clock sometime the show is not ready yet. And Villa will call me and say, oh, we stay. I say, boy, I'm up on the last scene. But we have to bring quality to you guys. And, and, and I, I am a stickler for that. Me, me, I'm probably one of the hardest person to work with, but I say, come and cuss when things now go home me and think it for God. Yep. Yeah, so me tell me not care who. I'll feel like me tell about in parts if necessary. Yep. Yeah, so because, but I, I demand perfection. Yeah. I'm a hard, me the hardest person for myself when I do the right thing. So, in terms of the overall production, me dinner with Villa, every, every, if Villa calls me, no matter what time Villa calls me, what idea I'm having, I say, alright, let's see how we can make it work. And we'll try and make it work. So, head cook and back to wash. Yes, you are. It's a good description. Right. But uh, I enjoy it. I really enjoy it. I really enjoy it. Alright. Since you say your mouth now have no filter, tell me two or three of the hardest persons to work with well uh, that's that the easiest one wow. simone <laughs> Sim simone, that easy. simone. <laughs> um all right so the thing is you know simone can be such a great actor if she allow herself to be she I, but for some reason she don't want to go certain places she don't want to go you know the deep part them and ball and she don't want to do intimate scenes, she don't want to go up and kiss nobody and then something. Which okay, that's her choice. But I know, I see that if she does apply herself, she wanted the baddest actor then upon the show. 
But she just not apply herself. She not go past a certain part. She stay surface. But uh, it is what it is. Come in closer, girl. So, Colleen and Damien, tell us exactly when did you start this, this project? <laughs> we started in 2018. Uh, we both came back to Jamaica. He retired. And I told him that he was going to enjoy his retirement. And we just decided to take tourists around and have them here and just enjoy it like a permanent vacation. Was there any kind of inspiration? What, what, what made you decide that that is what you wanted? Because he loves to go all over <laughs> Jamaica. I love Negro, it's an yes. opportunity to go Negro more. Oh. <laughs> and then we build the place with, with a Negro feel. Oh, okay. So the, the inspiration was, was Negro. Yes. With this idea. Alright, so you are nestled in a farming community. Yes. Do you think that that's, that's an advantage? There are advantages. Many, many the tourists don't want the normal beach. A lot of them, they want to see what the place is like, what the people are like, the real life. We have it here. So, we can consider this one of the, one of the forms of community tourism. Yes. And um, you offer tours and stuff like that. Well, yes. it's called Calder Tours. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> tell us some of the places that the tour um, takes you to. From Negro to Portland. Oh, okay. Even a farm, if they want to go see a farm, we even take them to the schools when we talk with them. If a teacher comes, they want to see what the school is like, what the banks are like, they, they, what Linstead is like. Right. Just... No, you, you mentioned Linstead. <laughs> I'm sure that Linstead Market must be a part of the tour. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> because, we're, I mean, Linstead Market is... It's a famous market where, you know, it not sounds like people are telling us to carry active and mm -hmm. So, first of all, I think you're just in a place where um, tourists will want to see. They definitely want to see somewhere, especially where there's a farming community. Because um, I've traveled extensively and I know that when people come to Jamaica, many of them are no disrespect to the five-star hotels, mm -hmm. but some people really want to see a real slice of Jamaica. And I think that you offer it here a really true slice of China. Yeah. But they could walk on the street and talk. And, and talk with the average person. Average person, yeah. yes. Yeah. And, it's, and we have had many people visit and none left disappointed. They were all very, very satisfied with it. Have you had um, anybody returning? Anybody that oh, yes. met many of them? Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Including us, because <laughs> myself and Shelly were here for Shelly's birthday, and we did just know so I left the team come here, I left to let everybody know about this. We are we are here, we are in Uotan, actually, and, and this is not a place that people would put um, on, on our local map as a tourist resort, but you are now making it into a place where tourists can come and see a part of Jamaica that they would readily know. And I'm also licensed by the Jamaica Tourist Board. And you're fully licensed by the Jamaica Tourist Board. Um, I think you have a wonderful yeah. place here. And again, we want to thank you for hosting us. And we will definitely, with your people, when you're forward to Jamaica, they can definitely come to your town, come to Calder Tours, and you'll get a chance to see Negrillo, you'll get a chance to see just different places in Jamaica, and you'll get a chance to see farmland like real farmland, something that Jamaica is known for that is not necessarily a part of our immediate tourist um, remember I said, the, the, the whole plan so I think that this is a glorious opportunity for persons to come here it is very cozy, we have a pool and just the greenery, just the, the whole set of the place is very impressive to me and once again, we want to thank you very much for me Posting us here. And people, people talking about the food, you know that. And when you come on to food, I mean, when. when um, there, there is a story told us about her almost like wanting to cook her, not thinking that she was a cook. Yeah, so for some reason she thought she couldn't cook. <laughs> and she had somebody else cook for me. I said, oh no, forget me. Yeah, so you would be, yeah. So, so the, the food is one of the things, and the, and the and you are gracious. You are absolutely gracious. Thank you very much again, and we will be spreading the word. Call the tours. Double, double, that.
all that for is not a problem. And as Pink Boss said, Pink Boss said when him just forward, said, listen, if you don't come here, sir, you can't draw no car because all that course to every one of them. <laughs> every car. <laughs> okay. This has been the bartender road trip to Uatan here at Calda Tours. Yo, check it, don't wreck it. We'll make it on them one. Stop, stop! Somebody say bartender!